Hey guys, and welcome back to Mismanagement Part 9. In the last part, we moved to Duncan's place, and we still haven't met all of these characters. Like, who is this, and this, and this? Oh, yep, we're only missing three. I wonder who they are. I can't wait to see. I don't know how many seasons there are, but I definitely saw her in some of those pictures, and the cute little doggy. So, we're gonna hop in. It looked like he was back. Yep. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> captain of his ship well that wasn't so bad was it speak for yourself you're just running around like you always do I actually had to work hey my job is to work too people people you can't let the man turn you against each other ah Winston I'm glad you're here come my boy we have much to discuss uh hi Duncan I'm just here to fix a router someone said wouldn't boot up no, no. <laughs> I just told them that to get you here. What? You caught me all the way down here too. Listen, I understand you've been very helpful to Denise. An integral part of the team, I suppose, but... And surely you must realize what this, is, what this crew really needs is a captain. Am I right? A strong hand on the rudder? That's fine, but can't I go and... Tell me honestly, son. You probably grew up fatherless, didn't you? Gunned down when you were just a boy. Or maybe doing hard time, as they say. What? My dad's an anesthesiologist at the hospital down the street. Oh, uh, such a taxing job. I'm sure he never had time to shoot hoops with you. Actually, we go fishing every year at... But that's besides the point. You all need a role model. A father figure. Listen up, everyone. We are going to try something new again today. Get excited. Oh god. Today, young lads, you'll be cross-training your skills. Mavir, you're well-rounded, but you could use some work with your writing. Luke, a decent writer, but you ought to learn how to repair your own computer, so we'll give you some technical tasks. Whatever, man. Well, you can't let that hippie touch my- Ah, don't think I've forgotten about you, Winston. You need to work on developing your right brain. My what? You'll be doing art tasks today. Why don't you try doing them all with your left hand? Um, sir, do you really think that's- Oh, excellent idea, Mr. Morganston. I can continue handling the financial task. No, 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 Pearl. I have something different in mind for you. Hmm? You've been working so hard. As a lady of your experienced years, I'll just take it a bit easier. We don't want you your osteoporosis acting up. I don't have osteoporosis, but you might at your age, and we wouldn't want the company to have to pay for a hip replacement. I want you to take a break, sit on the couch, and relax, my dear. Meanwhile, I'll be improving my hand-eye coordination at the arcade. Captain's life is never easy. Alright, everyone, let's get to work. Well, I never! All of you, just keep your hands off my game machine. <sighs> That was interesting. <laughs> Cross training. That's a mess. Okay, Winston, 12 art tasks, 12 writing tasks for him, 12 technical tasks. Then 80 seconds of that, and Pearl sits and does nothing for 100 seconds. So, who's doing art? Okay. Mavir's doing writing. Who's doing art? Tunkins. I mean, what's his face? Then he's doing technical. I guess Duncan's not really doing anything, but Mavir's already stressed out. Um, let me buy some donuts. Mavir really likes donuts. Here you go. You have quite a few tasks ahead of you. Let me give you another donut before you stress out, because Pearl has to sit there. Ugh. Knitting. He seems fine. <laughs> He's like, whatever. Okay, Mavir, you're almost done. We need more donuts. I'm coming, I'm coming. 
can do at least tasks, so he's fine. She needs 20 more seconds. He has gotten like no tasks at all. He's almost done. And he should be on the other cave. It's gonna stress Duncan out to no end. These aren't in one day or something, okay. Okay, you're good. What is this? Take a smoke break ahead. And he wants to take a nap on the couch. No problem, I'll just finish all your tasks, my love. Oh, Luke's gonna finish first. Do we know my writing task? Oh, okay. I didn't even know that the day was almost over. Okay, let's take a nap. Once you finish all your tasks, take a nap. I don't care. Um, who's doing art? You are. Do you guys finish your tasks? Do whatever your side tasks are. I don't give a cheese. You only have three more to do. You have to catch up like crazy. And no writing tasks have come in for a while. So you might not get to take your nap for a while. There we go. One more, Luke. And then you can do whatever your heart desires. Ooh, my viewers catching up. Who's gonna win? Not, not Winston. Ooh, the tie. Next task wins. Ah. What would you like to do now? Water cooler? Listen to the radio, go ahead. I'll turn it on. Probably have nothing to get stressed about, you trash. Okay, Mavier is done too. Then you can go nap. Winston. Okay, great. Go nap. You can do that. He doesn't have to do financial tasks anymore, so Winston, those are all you. I think he's gonna want to do those tasks. 58 seconds, he's not finishing that today. 40, she wants to take another, a longer smoke break, be my guest. Oh, sorry, or I'll go. And he's like, I haven't gotten to play the arcade game. I haven't done any work in two days. Pay is pay. <laughs> But you're gonna you're gonna kill Winston. And he still has two art tasks that he has to do. Okay, go play. Oh, it's seven seconds. Go play anyway. Oh, Winston, see if you can get this done. Oh, nope. Okay, so what was just? He finished his nap. He got one second, and he had another art task to do. So right now. He needs to do some more art tasks. He wants to listen to music. She wants to smoke. He just has two art tasks to get done. There we go, perfect. And then he probably wants to go play his game. You can go play for right now. Awesome. I'll turn off the radio now then. And when Duncan Winston's done, he wants to play, she wants to smoke. And that's about it. Okay, you're back, Pearl. You're doing art tasks. And he just needs to play for 50 seconds. I should have let him do it before. And I've wasted so much time. Okay, now Winston wants to play on the arcade machine for 70 seconds. Oh god, that means he's going into tomorrow. Okay, so that's gonna be it for this part. Um, you know what? No, it isn't. Okay, so the next episode is short leave, shore leave. I was telling everyone to stop working so much. And who's this new girl? His niece? We meet someone new. Honestly, I've never had to work directly with Duncan and I'm shocked. You weren't around when he got hooked on his motivational speaking fad. Oops. <clears throat> Attention everyone. 
I have some more announcements to make. Oh, good lord, what now? Uh, it has come to my attention that the mandatory workload I previously instituted may have been a little much for some of you. What? He's actually changing his mind? As I've always said, the hallmark of good leadership is flexibility. So starting now, as the captain of the ship, I'm declaring some shore leave. What? Like, we're going to the beach? That sounds awesome. <laughs> well, we actually do have to get some work done. No, no avoiding that. But as of today, we should try not to do more than four tasks in a day. Four tasks? Only four in a whole day? Oh wait, that's not her voice. <laughs> How in the world do you expect us to keep this place from falling apart? Hmm. Now surely, um, perhaps we could take turns so that not everyone is on shore leave in the same day. Right you are, Denise, and call me Duncan. I'll leave you to sort out the details. Ah, and one other thing. This poor Indian lad, Mavir, he was clearly far too overworked and I gave him some time off. Right, I'm sure he was dog, dog tired from all that napping. What, what, why is my phone always ringing? Four tasks in a day and been short and I'm, four tasks in a day and we're short an employee. Oh ho ho! No need to worry, Pearl. I've brought in a replacement for Tara. She's quite the little graphic designer. This is Ashley. Hello, everyone. I'm sure we'll have a marvelous time working together. Pleased to meet you, Ashley. Uncle Donkey, I simply must go powder my nose, yes? Powder your nose? Be a dear, and do let me know if this shipment I ordered from Clinique arrives. Clinique? Is, is that some sort of medical supply company? No, no, sir. Just makeup. Oh, uh, I see. Um, alright, everyone. Back to work. Gracious, I need a cigarette. I need to beat my high school on challenge mode. Dude, I need to get away from these clouds of cigarette cancer. Uncle Dunky, that had better not be a cigarette smoke I smell. Nicotine could affect my hair color, and this style cost eight hundred dollars. Everything all right, Duncan? Oh yes, yes. Denise, will you show Ashley around for me? Oh, uh, uh, sure. She's your niece, is that right? Well, sort of. My sister's husband's niece. Family is from Manhattan. Barely know them. Not really my type of people, you know. Well, yeah, I can show her around. Thank you, good lass. I wouldn't know what to do with her. She's just so, so girly. Makeup, hair, color. Um, I'm a girl too, sir. Oh, of course, I know that. But at least you wear trousers like a man. I can relate to you. Now, what's this here I hear about new video game high score? Perfect place to show my competitive camadre with good old Winston. Camadre? Trousers. Oh, <laughs> I didn't even know she was talking. I kind of like... And I kind of like these capris. So I'm going to end it there. And in the next part, we're going to jump in on this work day. Freshen up in the bathroom eight times. Good Lord Jesus. Okay, so I'll see you. Oh, Ashley, Prada, Louis Vuitton, Jimmy Choo. You know, the important things in life. Artist, good at art, but terrible at any... Wow. Freshening up in the bathroom. She likes eligible bachelors and shoes dislikes other people hawking the bathroom smoke air conditioning and music she's annoying so i will see you guys next time i love you so so much goodbye